friends welcome to our channel today we are going to share a special dinner combo recipe with you chili paneer corn fried rice and fresh grape juice chili paneer is a popular indo chinese recipe which is prepared by fried paneer in chili sauce with diced capsicum and onion Sweet corn fried rice recipe is a quick, easy and delicious Indian Chinese style stir fried rice that everyone will love. Fresh black grape juice. Homemade fresh grape juice is healthy, hygienic and easy to make. Now, let's move on to our recipe. Our first recipe is chili paneer. The main ingredients needed for preparing chili paneer is 400 grams paneer, 2 onions, Capsicum, you can use red, yellow and green color. For making the batter, you require 4 tablespoon corn flour or all-purpose flour, half tablespoon pepper powder, 1 tablespoon red chili powder, salt to taste and sunflower oil for deep frying. For making the chili paneer, you require 10 cloves of garlic, 2 chilies, green chilies, 1 tablespoon vinegar, 1 tablespoon soya sauce, 2 tablespoon tomato sauce, 1 tablespoon red chili powder, half tablespoon pepper powder and salt to taste. Soak the paneer in lukewarm water for 10 to 15 minutes. Drain the excess water and keep it separate in a strainer. Now take a large bowl. Add 4 tablespoon corn flour or all-purpose flour. Add 1 tablespoon red chili powder, salt to taste, half tablespoon pepper powder to it. Mix it well by adding little water. Make a smooth batter. The density of the batter to be prepared for this recipe should be maintained properly so that the paneer is coated well. Then add cubed paneer pieces and gently mix it with the batter. Keep it aside for 20 minutes. Now dice the capsicum and onion. Chop the green chilies and garlic. Now heat oil in a pan and fry all the marinated paneer pieces until it turns into golden color. Remove it in a flat plate and set aside for later use. Now take a frying pan, take the remaining oil, then in the remaining oil add chopped garlic. Now add diced capsicum and onion pieces. Cook for 5 minutes on low flame. Then add red chili powder, pepper powder, salt, vinegar, soya sauce, tomato sauce and mix it well. Now add the fried paneer pieces and mix it well with the masala. Cook for 5 minutes on low flame. Now it is ready to serve and serve with any main dish. Now we will move on to our next recipe, sweet corn fried rice. Sweet corn fried rice. The main ingredient for this is 2 cups of basmati rice, half cup sweet corn, 100 grams carrot and beans, half tablespoon soya sauce, 1 tablespoon vinegar, half tablespoon pepper powder, half lemon juice, salt to taste, water, cooking oil. Rinse 2 cups of basmati or any other long grain rice very well till the water runs clear of starch. Soak rice in water for 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, drain all the water and keep the rice aside. Now in a pot, add water, add half tablespoon salt and half lemon juice. Bring the water to boil. Add the soaked and drained rice to the hot water. On a medium to high flame, Cook the rice without the lid. Cook till the rice grain becomes all dent or just cooked. Remove the pot from the fire and strain the rice. While straining, you can also gently rinse the rice in water so that they stop cooking and don't stick to each other. Cover the rice and keep it aside till the rice cools completely. Now, take a frying pan, heat 2 tablespoon oil and sort the garlic cloves. Also sort chopped carrots, beans and half cup sweet corn on high flame for 2 to 3 minutes. Now add pepper powder, little salt and vinegar. Sort on high flame for 30 seconds. Add the 2 cups of cooked basmati rice, add soya sauce, mix it gently without breaking the rice grains. 
serve the corn fried rice with chili pani or enjoy as it is now we are ready with our chili paneer and corn fried rice. Now we will make some homemade juice, black grape juice. Fresh black grape juice. The main ingredients needed are organic black grapes, sugar, water, ice cubes and fresh lemon juice. Rinse the black grapes well and drain it. Place the grapes into the blender. First blend it slightly and add the sugar. Then dilute with water, add lemon juice, throw few ice cubes and blend again till it is smooth. Hope you all enjoyed our video. Really, it's very tasty and super dinner combo. Do try it. We are sure you will really enjoy it.